It's kind of a pity because they're really pretty. Torrey Pines are one of the things that make San Diego famous, but if you spend a lot of time in that area, you may have noticed the trees aren't doing very well. New at 5 o'clock, ABC 10 News reporter Jeff Lasky reveals why the trees are now under attack in two different ways. It's a gorgeous day for hiking at Torrey Pines, but the Torrey Pines themselves aren't as gorgeous as they used to be. You can't help but seeing like a lot of the trees are dying. Todd Marowitz is one of the many hikers noticing the pine needles starting to sag and in many cases going brown. They asked California State Park scientist Darren Smith about the ailing trees. Its existence is the only reason this land got protected and preserved. I mean, these would be uh, big golf courses and really nice houses if it weren't for the Torrey Pine tree. Smith says for about a decade, the Torrey Pines here have been under attack by bark beetles. But now the trees are getting hit with something else, a fungal disease called pitch canker, likely carried from tree to tree by the beetles. Since arriving in the Torrey Pines Reserve three years ago, it's spread throughout the entire park. The name of the disease comes from what you can literally see with your own eyes. Canker is the actual sore. There's one on this branch of the Torrey Pine right next to me. And pitch is the resin that the tree spits out, trying desperately to heal itself. The problem is that the beetles weaken the trees to the disease and the disease may attract more beetles. And all that happens is climate change puts additional stress on the ecosystem. What we don't know is how the trees are going to respond. We don't know whether they're going to die, whether they're going to be sick, what proportion of the population is going to remain. Smith says as many as half of the 3,200 Torrey Pines in the area are showing some signs of infection. Direct action likely carries more risk than benefits, so the plan is to hope the trees will be resilient and that most will survive. At the same time, they're using advanced science to find new places to plant Torrey Pines where they have the best chance to thrive. Hope's not lost if we do have a catastrophe. Um, that said, we're, we're trying to protect our most charismatic you know, creature we have here in the park to the best of our ability. At Torrey Pines, Jeff Lasky, ABC 10 News.